G'day Smoke and Dagger fans, it's game day. What day is it, son? You've got a big hunger for some big plays? Well, you're gonna need a big food lineup. So let's follow along. Got yourself in a twist? Grab some pork belly twisties. These will sort you out. All right, folks, grab your pork belly, give it a good slap. We're gonna dice this into slices, approximately one centimeter thick. Once that's done, we're gonna grab a skewer we're going to skewer it on and we're going to gently twist it around. Don't worry about getting it perfect. Once it's on, you can adjust it. Set these aside in the fridge and we'll salt them just before they go on the smoker. Looking for that perfect burger but you don't want any curveballs? Check out these bacon and onion patties. Perfect for game day. All right, folks, for this, you're gonna need an onion, some burger mints, and some streaky bacon. Start by grabbing an onion and slicing it into approximately one centimeter slices. Once this is done, pop the insides out. Be careful not to break your onion ring here. Today, we're using Meat Graffiti MVP. Stuff your mints inside and apply some rub. Once the mince is inside, Lay your bacon down, fold it over like this, and wrap it. Do this two times. And then grab a skewer, and make sure everything's held in place nicely. Lovely. Looking for something that packs a punch? Why not try these barbecue shotgun shells? They're sure to impress. All right, for these bad boys, you're gonna need some pasta, manicotti, or cannelloni, cheese of your choice, and some mints. We're using meat graffiti, smoky chipotle. We're gonna grate that cheese up. Now chuck it in with the mints and rub of your choice. Combine it all together. Once this is all nicely combined, we're going to gently stuff this mixture into our pasta. Helps if you give it a cheeky roll beforehand. Don't apply too much downwards pressure, otherwise your pasta is going to split. Once this is done, we're going to grab our streaky bacon and wrap it around the outside. Do your best to cover as much as possible. We're gonna set these aside in the fridge for approximately six hours, so the pasta has a chance to soften. Is it game day, Reggie? <coughs> for the burgers, we're gonna smoke these for approximately 60 minutes. We're gonna add some barbecue sauce on at the end, and just let that sit for approximately 10 to 15 minutes. For the shotgun shells, we're going to smoke them for about an hour and a half at 120C or 250F. And then towards the end, we're going to crank the temperature about 170, 300F. I'm going to add some sauce and get them nice and glistening. For the pork belly twisties, we're going to hit them with a big dose of salt and a little bit of rubber your choice. We want that to crackle on the outside when we chuck it in. Look at that, lovely. For the pork belly twisties, I'm gonna chuck them on about 220C or approximately 428 Fahrenheit for 20 to 25 minutes.
when all this is done, you got yourself a great game day platter. Perfect for a game or a fight. So sit down, grab yourself a beer, and it's time. Let's go.